What's going on guys? Kleepas Tech here, coming back at you with another video. In this video, I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial on how to take a screenshot with the Humidigi A11. Taking a screenshot is a pretty basic common feature, but the Humidigi A11 has several ways to do it, as well as a few different options you can change in the settings, so I'm going to go over all of it. Before we go any further, I do want to remind you to hit that subscribe button. It really does help out the channel a lot. That being said, let's get into it. So the basic way to take a screenshot with this phone that most people are probably going to know is by pressing and holding the power key and the volume down key at the same time. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. This little menu is going to show up where you can share it, edit it, do whatever you want. But there's also another way to do it and it's not activated by default. So I'm going to show you how to actually get it enabled first. We're going to go to the settings. Smart Assistant, Gesture Control, and Three Finger Screenshot is going to be right here. Once this is activated, all you need to do to take a screenshot is simply put three fingers on your screen and go like this. There's a little bit of a delayed reaction, but it's pretty easy to use. And this feature is not to be confused with the motion you can take as a shortcut to the camera, which is like this. I personally don't really like to have both things activated at once just because it's a little confusing but at the same time if you like it you can definitely have both of them on at the same time it's just a little bit more to get used to. The other thing you can do is turn the screenshot sound on and off. So to do this we're going to go back into settings, go to smart assistant and hit screenshot right here and you can simply just turn it off or on. Now another feature that's really similar to screenshots that I'm going to show you is screen recording. There are a few settings you can change having to do with screen recordings on this phone, but first I'm going to show you how to actually make one. So all you need to do is drag down your quick menu and scroll to the left and screen record start is right here. You're going to hit start. So taking a screen recording is, as you can see, really easy to do, but there are also some settings you can change. So to get to those settings, we're going to go to settings, smart assistant, and screen record. So we have a few different settings here. The first one that really stands out is record time. Right now it's set to five minutes, so it'll record your screen for five minutes and five minutes only. You can change this and choose between 5, 10, and 30 minutes depending on what you're doing. The other thing you can do is have it record a narration. So this is pretty cool. If you're trying to do a tutorial or something like that, you can also record audio while you're recording the screen. So then you can narrate what you're doing and I think that that's pretty useful in some situations. The other thing you can do is activate what's called operational feedback and that's going to show the touches on the screen when you're recording the screen. But that was my quick tutorial on taking screenshots and screen recordings with the Humidigi A11. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope you found this information useful as well. If you did, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video.